So this free game is all about being a humble little farmer who, I guess, has to harvest his potatoes the old-fashioned way through <laughs> bloody combat. <laughs> the faster I click, too, the faster his attack speed actually will go up. He's at 1.5, and I mean, let's face it, he seems to be murdering thousands of potatoes. This farmer is someone I feel like we could all look up to. Do I evolve? Is this like an XP bar? <laughs> What is this talent tree? Here, just go into whatever this is. Oh, and I see. I'm getting a crap ton of potatoes every time I kill one, so I can do things like increase my HP and regen up to like 10, increase attack up to 10. I've got so many more potatoes. Screw it. HP, you go up to 30. Potato damage, you go up to 30. 50? 50 even? Yeah, okay, now it's getting a little pricey. What is this? I get a little achievement? Fun. I'm also seeing that I got a hat that I can equip. Looks like this thing gives me a little bit more dex and potatoes earned. It's really not much, but it's something. Okay, so it looks like if I can make it further and further into the levels, I'll unlock more stuff on this hot bar. I think I just need to make it 20 more waves before I get my next little thing here. The only issue is I am slowly losing health. And by slowly, I mean pretty rapidly. They just killed me. So maybe we start increasing potatoes earned. I don't know, about like an extra 60% increase. That should start giving me a whole bunch more money. Yeah, here's HP and regen. That should help. Also, for whatever reason, I have 400. 170 skulls in here. I don't know how I earn those, but I know I can spend them all the same. Is this an extra 100% attack and an extra 100% health and regen? Can't hate that. Here, have 20% more attack. The best defense is a good offense, and currently my offense is slaughtering potatoes holding shields and axes. Oh, I got another talent point too. More health. Hey, I know I'm fighting for my life against an unending army of potatoes, but what if I played a carnival game instead? It's a whack a potato. I don't know what Okay, I'm assuming click green, don't click red. I clicked red, dang it. What does this do for- it gave me 50 souls, yay. There's so much I don't understand. Oh hey, I reached 1-1-64, so I got access to this thing. Oh, if I beat the boss in World 100, then I think I can head over to Area 2. Seems pretty good. E doesn't seem like that's gonna work though. They're kind of ripping me to shreds. Whoops. Oh, also I just got a crap ton of skulls after my run ended. I'm starting to think I understand. More tech, more tech, more tech, more tech. And now I've got what? 239,000 potatoes in the bank. Increased class XP earned. Here, let's at least get that to be 80. More potatoes earned again also. And then I can get an extra 20% uh, health and regen. Whoa, hey, I did these quests too. What do I do with these things? I wish I could tell you. I simply could not. I picked up this shield that gave me a little bit of extra constitution, I think. Should help my defenses a little bit more. Let's talent point you up. Got 35,000 HP now. I wish I could see like my attack damage total. It's enough to at least two shot these guys. That's something, right? Oh wait, here it is. 4.7 thousand damage. That's, you know, not half bad. In that case, crank up my damage by 90% more. That should like let me start one shotting most of these guys. Yeah, I mean, it seems like it's working. Now I know what you're thinking. What did these potatoes ever do to me? Doesn't matter. They're rushing at me with weapons. That's like the number one way you're allowed to actually fight somebody. Ooh, better shield. Get recycled. Oh, shoes. Put that on. Wait, what happened? Oh, I just beat 1-1. One -one. I didn't even realize. So I can go over to area two now. Things should be a little bit more difficult here. Yeah, there's a much faster swarm of potatoes that start running at me like that for some reason. But now it should start giving me a higher gear rating. Also leveled up again, more constitution. So now if I can get to 1-2-50, I'll get yet another button I can click down here. So far my health seems like it's at max going all the way to 18. I'm feeling a little bit confident. I think I wanna try and save my skull until I can get this attacks per second thing. Wait, hang on. What's this tab? Boost the attack upgrade? What does that mean? I mean, I'll do it. And the HP and regen upgrade. That gave me like an extra 20,000 health. Whoa, I also got a new thing. I really and truly have no idea. I think I'm like farming potatoes that I can then use to like buy other stuff. I'll let that do its thing for a little bit while I proceed to slaughter all of these stupid other potatoes. Did I get any good gear drops? Yes. Better gloves. Worse shield. Get that out of here. I guess I'm lucky there hasn't been any like freaky mutated super mega potatoes or anything quite yet. Also, more HP and regen. Thank you. Increased fighting efficiency. What does this mean? Whatever. More potatoes earned. Honestly, I think I just want to try and max that up to 160,000, 180 now. All right. Fighting efficiency up to 20. Just buy a few more regen and HP upgrades. Yeah, it looks like the potatoes don't seem to want to die quickly anymore. Not exactly ideal for me in staying alive. Oh, but wait, I'm at 99. Hang on, I might be able to survive 
Five World 1 2. Answer? Yes. Keep going. I think this is the last little bit. Dude, look at how much health they have. This is an absolute brawl. Hang in there, Mr. Farmer. Please stab him. Stab him. Stab him. <laughs> yes. And now we go to 1 3. There's a windmill in the back. That's how you know it's official. Oh, they, they do not die quick at all. A little concerning, I'll be honest. But they do give me better gear. Put that on. What do you got now? Better luck, better agility, better decks. Dude, better luck should be great for more drops. And screw it. I'm just going to one by one increase this attack per second. It's at 2.45 now. I don't know what the exact math is for that but i mean you can just tell by my animation i'm attacking a little bit faster which should hopefully be keeping me alive also let me drink all three of these potions that i own turns out you have souls you can you know spend so if i spend them on potions well for the next two hours i have 50 percent more xp 50 percent more xp and potatoes and 65 percent more attack and hp it's like taking steroids before hitting a home run it looks cool so no one really cares <laughs> oh finally a new weapon too dude my club has had a item rating of five this one's an item rating of 40 now should have much more strength on my body also i wanted to come over to these talent points that increased potato percentage area 1-3 uh still gonna definitely kill me not the ideal situation to find yourself in but i'm seeing that i can actually go to area 1-4 now which has a max item rating of 300 with two bonuses it's like twice as gear effective as 1-3 so i'm wondering if i head over here and just let myself get a lucky drop from my bag if that will be like a huge difference also increase my potatoes earned to 200 percent i still no idea what this does i try to buy this and i just don't have enough money i'll just leave it alone for now also wow i know i came here to farm gear drops but they kind of kill me quick oh hey what do you know i got a gear drop did it help nope got murdered <laughs> here maybe we spend 800 skulls on getting an extra 134 percent health and regen it seems like we stay alive slightly longer now. I mean, what? We're at 360,000 HP. It still seems to uh, get murdered somewhat quickly, but, you know, that's, that's besides the point. Oh, I unlock turnips? When? How? Oh, I'm constantly gaining money, huh? Because once I finish growing a tree, it gives me the production permanently. I get this part now. Uh, well, I just planted an onion that's going to take two minutes, so. Also, with my potato earning rate, I can go up 75% more in my attack damage. I don't think it's going to be a huge difference, but I went back down to 1-3. Not because I was tired of getting my teeth kicked down my throat, but because still a lot of my gear isn't even above level 100 yet. And this can drop level 150 gear here, so I might as well try and farm where I can actually kill potatoes oh also uh more potato earned oh hey i can play whack-a-mole again see how well i can do this time i oh i got an attack buff dude i didn't know i could win those from here go mr farmer go the goddess of attack is on your side is this thing bugging out by chance why is it it's constantly climbing and constantly giving me more per second let's check back in on that later how are we doing made it up to 68 in this level i'm going to get an extra 129 percent to my health that puts me over what half a million now wow here let's Let's increase my fighting efficiency then too i still no idea what that does but you tell me in here no no it doesn't this thing's still going up on its own pace yeah no i'm at what twenty four thousand now wow also much better gauntlets at 135 so those puppies on and much better shoes here too yeah new farming at 150 wasn't a bad idea come on i'm at 196 also just keep just hang in there with your health buddy hang on wait i know what to do increase hp and regen through skulls increase hp and regen through potatoes please you're at 100 stay in there no it was so close it's fine by the time i get back there i should have enough upgrades put where i want them to make it happen wait spawn more potatoes at once by that every five kills is what takes me up here so if i'm spawning more potatoes i mean there's a like higher likelihood that i'll die of course but it also means i fly through waves faster whenever they're just little peons that i can chop down what a good upgrade also i'm about to be able to spend a hundred thousand to get another plot here now that that's unlocked put some more radishes down please Ooh, increase skulls earned too i mean i'm not gonna see an immediate result but i'll take that boost potato upgrade yeah, yeah no, no, might as well might as well okay how are we doing on items we're getting a hundred score value club rest is trash Okay, and here we go. Everything's spawning in faster yet again, but you see that I'm like still flying up through the ranks. I think I might actually stand a chance at surviving this wave. Murder all those. Yes, 1-3-100, and then just kill the rest of the potatoes. That's all we have to do. They've all spawned. Hang in there. Hang in there. Come on. Please, murder them, murder them, murder them. Yes. Time for my next area. Oh, a shirt. I haven't got one of these before yet. And I'm currently sitting on 2 million potatoes also. Might seem crazy going into class XP with it. Look at how fast this bar fills up now. 
Yep, better hat, better shirt. I went from dying immediately to making it past level 30 here at least. Seems like a nice little boost. I think I'm also about to be level 100. It's like what, every 10 points I get a skill, I think. Answer, yeah, that checks out. Ooh, I get two this time. More into potato boost. And now let's start upgrading our attack damage. Increase the attack that strength provides by two. I don't know mathematically what that comes out to, but it's gotta be good, right? Whoa, new potion. Increase skulls earned. Take them both. Actually, wait a second. I got a new tab down here. What is this? I got worms, breeding worms. Oh, so every potato I kill, there's a 0.01% chance that I find a worm. Or if I kill 25,000 of them, worm god just gives them to me. Well, that's nice. Oh, I see, but it looks like with my worm poop, I can like increase levels here for attack. So like now I've got a 5% attack boost, 5.4, 5.6. That makes sense. These worms could actually be extremely helpful. Oh, 233 rating. Lucky. And more strength. Again, fairly certain this is bugged because my radishes aren't doing it, but I'm not going to touch it at all. Now I should be at, yeah, over 5 million potatoes over here. Cool, 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 cool. I can get an extra 100% boost to my fighting efficiency or like 150% increase to my attack damage. Let's go with that. I feel like I've been neglecting it for a while. Oh, yes, and I even have skulls. 2.5 attacks per second here and an extra 50% boost to my attack upgrade. Again, don't know how to translate that, but uh, you know, I trust it. So now we're at 1.3 million health with an attack damage of 282,000. Oh, fighting efficiency is a multiplier applied to my attack damage. So it's a 1.66. If I increase it to 136%, what does that end up being now? 2.366. So my attack is now 293,000. Okay, what's like a simple 10 boost then? 294,000? Oh, that's not horrible, right? Okay, I'll take a risk. What happens if I plant another one of these? Nothing broke. It just added more to this little number. All right. Oh, I beat 1-4 while I was doing that. Dude, there's so many things in this game to do. Like for instance, go to world 1-5 now. Should be able to get even better gear here. I really only pulled better boots out of all that, it seems. God, I gotta get my luck up. Look at that. I got 32 more poop also. Start to put this into more HP and regen bonus then. Wow, we're leveling up really quickly because I've got yet another talent point to spend. I guess these guys drop more and more XP the higher the health they have. I mean, I guess that makes sense. So what if I was theoretically earning like a hundred percent more potatoes every kill and then let's get a 50 percent increased hp and regen again that gave me like an extra 500,000 health and more potato upgrade for you please my next little area i can unlock is 1-8 but at 1-6-25 i can get my next like potato upgrade tab so depending on how far i can get in this world i might just try and jump for it oh cool i got a unique achievement don't know what any of that means never do also i've just kept trying to grow these things because i think it's boosting up how many i'm getting maybe it's not a bug i really have no idea i think i need like a crazy smart scientist to break that down for me more evade chance i don't really want to go through this one but might as well there's more skulls here and then this one's lock which then leads into more skulls okay well at 1-5 we're able to get to well level 50 i'll just ride this out to see how far i can go but get any better gear oh yes 200 damage weapon and better boots got like a little baby dagger now and i am just flailing my hands around i have no actual training it's just called the yeah go away tactic and you know it works for the most part yeah it looks like the more of these that i grow actually this number just keeps going up by its like base whatever do something crazy with that more evasion sadly i don't think i'm gonna be able to survive all the way to 100 but that's okay let's see if we can survive all the way to 25 on this one. Oh no it looks like in this world it takes 10 potato spawns to go to the next segment wow they're shredding through my health real real quick that's not good not good at all even if i'm max attack speed right from jump i don't think i can hang on long enough to make it to 25 yeah i kind of stop at seven man that's fine here's like a 200 percent boost to my hp oh there's a fewer potatoes needed per wave thing that actually might end up being pretty helpful also here's almost a 200 percent attack boost wait hang on what's my attack right now 744,000. so if i mm, click that 1.24 million damage yeah that's pretty good I'm sure that'll help looks like the skull upgrades are really something that i should not have neglected as much as i did whoops Oh, dude, and if I reach level 250, I can get these next two. God, there's so much I gotta do. I'm feeling overwhelmed. Maybe I just like complaining. I guess two things can be true. In the market, I can sell 10 of my whatever plants here to get like a little boost. So now there's a 4% bonus. Did that do anything? Oh yeah, it just took the amount of plants that I grew over here and just kind of dropped it down slightly. I feel like that might have been worth it. Also, because I decreased the amount of potatoes that I needed to kill for each wave, I mean, I'm kind of just skating through this. Like, I think I'm about to be done with world five extremely easily 99 100 all potatoes
potatoes spawned, all potatoes being eviscerated in front of their friends, loved ones, and allies, and you're dead. All right, world six, we go. My extra attack damage actually might come in handy here. Yeah, murdering them much quicker, at least. I mean, I'm still being murdered pretty quick myself, mind you, but still. And if I were to spend enough skulls to get this up to 200, what then game? Make it up to 16, 17, any chance this wants to speed on up to 25 real quick? Any chance at all that wants to speed up to 25 and let me stay like, dang it, I got to 21. That's okay, I'll stay here for a bit and put on the 300 gear score weapon. Screw it, when in doubt, spam HP. That was like an extra 40% increase. How we doing, 22, 23? Stay in there, stay in there. Do not go down, whatever you do. Yes, 25. What can we get? No, it's something stupid like worm drop chance wait 0. 0.50 hang on like on top of what's happening here or did i just get like a crazy much much higher chance to find worms hard to say well the fun news is now that i'm 10 levels off level 200 i almost have this next skull upgrading thing in here i can unlock also my attack is 1.62 but i've got enough skulls in the bank to get another 50 percent boost so i'm just gonna do that now we're at 1.99 million damage it still takes like four hits to kill these things sometimes a little bit concerning i would say here maybe i should spend and all my potatoes and stuff to get a fighting efficiency of 200%. Game, you want to give me a little bit more here? Just like a, just a crumb. There we go. What are we at now? 2.05. See, that helps. I'll be honest, with that attack boost, I'm making it decently far. I'm about to be at the halfway point. I think that's when I unlock, yeah, world 1-7. Do I want to go take a peek though? I feel like they're going to actually put my own foot in my throat. I don't know if I'm that strong yet. Game. What can I make it to here at least? 57? Might as well go see. Potatoes. Form. What are we working with here? Yep, yep, yep. My foot going into my own throat. Look at how fast my health is going down. Wow. Hey, look, I made it to world three or level three. <laughs> Sorry, I know my place. I'll go back. I'll go back to where I belong. The great news is that I have two upgrade points, so I'm getting 20% more skulls now. Oh, wow. That's a much better helmet, too. So what is my current gear score boost? An extra 33% potatoes earned, 30% class XP. Almost a 2x in my constitution, too, but at least everything's like a 1.5. Yeah, we're making it much further. I think we're going to get to 170, 1-6-70, that is. Or maybe 68. Yeah, that's close enough. Oh, dude, I didn't even realize I passed level 200. It looks like my next little upgrade is the class XP upgrade here. So now what? We'll get 50% more of that. Screw it. 100% more of that. Oh, I'm uh, I'm leveling up much faster. Oh, hey, what do you know? Let's also get like an extra 50% boost to my HP and regen upgrades. Oh, wait, I need like 40 more skulls for that. Fine. Then what if I like <laughs> boosted it by another 100%? I get the feeling I'm about to start skyrocketing in my levels here. I had a feeling going into that skull talent thing would be good too, but I've gotten 8,000 skulls off one run. That's enough to get an extra 50% boost to my attack, so I go from 2.89 million, click, into 3.44, and then I can even boost my HP up by an extra 50%, so now I'm sitting at 12 million HP, and 50% more skulls. Leveling up is truly the wave. Do I have better gear yet? Yes, some better gloves at least. I don't know, I guess potato spawn speed could be useful? The fact after they all like spawn and group up, I guess the faster I get all my rewards and stuff. And now in my talent tree, I can do the fun thing of getting more luck. My luck stat's currently 689, but the higher that is, the better the drops that I can get, which boost, you know, everything. So hopefully by getting that up pretty stupid crazy high, we can really get things going. All right, combo time. I basically just want the attack bonus back because then I think I can actually break through world six or it's an HP buff this time. Honestly, that still might work. More luck. Wait. I figured it out. I get these potatoes because I've grown the radishes, not the other way around. So if I plant three of these trees like so, and then just wait five minutes, I should be able to get something cool. Also, last push, we made it to 100. Stay in, keep fighting, don't you die. Don't you dare die. Yes! To world seven, go. You can get a max gear rating of 700 now. That's pretty crazy. Oh God, there's so many of these things. Oh, I caused a leak in the water well, whoops. Here, let's crank up the amount of skulls that I'm earning a little bit more. Jump over to my actual skull upgrade area. Dump some more in for evasion and critical hit chance, but I'm not really going to use those ever. Instead, I can try and increase my attack and HP the old-fashioned way here. Up to an extra 600%, another 50% to those boosts. That gave me an extra 4 million health. And then I really probably should start boosting up the potato upgrade for this thing again. It's extremely helpful. I just kind of keep forgetting. <laughs> I've got five goldfish for brains. They don't work. Wow, my better shield, finally at 96 great my goal here is to beat the stupid final level but it looks like to do that i have to beat 1-9 hang in there little farmer we'll get you through eventually or maybe i'll just suffer for a while that's that's an option i have i guess 
So what's my... I'm at 6.87 million damage now. What does a 30% fighting efficiency increase by me? Nothing. Or maybe the fighting efficiency made it where I'm dealing like 18 now? I don't know. It, oh yeah, this is the final damage dealt. So I'm 6.9 million times 3.30. Oh, so fighting efficiency is actually extremely good now, I understand. Well, fun promise you, I made it up to 7-36. So at least that's going well. Oh, my plants are done. Okay, see, I can get one of these, which means every second I get three of these things, thus giving me more and more of these little potato farms per second now, thus giving me more and more potatoes per second now. So I should always have been planting the largest thing possible, basically. Oh, well, now that I know that, when I come back to it in 30 minutes, it's gonna be insane. Oh, finally, luck five. What's connected to that? More skull increase? Weird. Anyways, 50% more class XP. Yeah, that's a nice boost. I, I like that. Let me do that with potatoes too. Come on, get to 50, please. I think I get a new unlock whenever I do. Just survive for like a little bit longer. If you don't, I'll hate you forever, I think. And I hate you forever. All right. And at least give me more skulls. 10% increase. Wow, that gave me 9,000 skulls, huh? Here, let's try increasing my attack by 50%. What is it? 10 million? Quick. Oh, look at that. Now it's 11. Yeah, if I can get to dash 50, I'll unlock the next little potato upgrade bar option thing. Please, game. I need this. Oh, yeah. I'm almost level 300 now, too. And there it is. Oh, that gave me two levels. Sick. Both of you into skulls. I don't get skulls like as it progresses. I need to die for it first. But I mean, when I get there, it works out extremely well. Dude, I haven't been checking my backpack either. That's a much better shield. That should help. Hopefully. Come on. You're so close. You're so close. You just got to make it like two more stages. Please hang in there. Hang in there. Yes! At 50. Does that count? Does that count or do I need to beat it? Yes! Increase confection XP. What does that mean? I don't know. Seems like maybe it was good though. Also, I'm getting 4 million potatoes a second now, so it's a fun little boost. And with three more of these little guys, now I make six of these plants a second, so now this is just going up at an even faster rate. Maybe a little bit of everything involved in this, huh? Oh, sick. 14,000 more skulls too. Let's go 50% more attack boost, 50% more HP and regen upgrade. What are we sitting at now? 33 million in the old health department. And with these boots that have a 422 gear score, that should help keep me alive. Also, I'm at 120% attack in here. Oh, crit chance and evade bonus. I forgot all about these. Here, you can get 50, you can get 50, you can get 50. The other 240 going into HP and regen bonus. I'm sorry, is this now a 1% critical chance that I just have permanently? To do like double damage, take all 50 from the attack and put them into that. Getting an extra 10% on that would still be crazy. Like that would actually change how hard I hit by a ton. Also, I know what you're wondering. Yes, I will be putting 10% more into skull game and 20% more into fighting efficiency through potatoes. I feel like skulls have very quickly become my primary currency here. Just something I've seemed to have noticed. God, they still kind of kicking my teeth down my throat, huh? Okay, so I am really curious about how many I get when I die. I'm at just over 500. Now I've got 16,000. That, yeah, that's pretty good. Oh. Uh, Oh, see, and you know, I, I really shouldn't neglect this base one now. I can do a 200% boost to my HP and regen. So what do I go from 36 million to 47 million? That's my bad. That's, I admit it. I admit it. I should have been upgrading my base form. But hey, look, my skulls are maxed out up here now. The hungry swarm of potatoes hopefully doesn't stand a chance. Ooh, better shirt. See, it looks like this is almost giving me an extra 10% critical chance bonus too. Very nice. Oh, hey, three more plants that are going to collect everything for me. How's this working now? I, I'm getting 20 million a second. Cool. I don't even know what I changed that has me at 58 million health. I do know though that with another talent point, I can increase my fighting efficiency by 10%. Uh, that button. So now I've got 14 million multiplied by 3.85. Pretty good boost. Let's try and increase my attack like an extra 200% here with potatoes. Hoping that starts to kill things a little bit better overall. I guess maybe upgrading this fewer potatoes needed per wave would also probably help me uh, not die as much. Cross that bridge when I get there. Come on, you can do it, farmer. You're at 95, 96 with 20-ish million health left. Here, here's more regen and HP. Good, I'll even start buying the ones just to try and help. Oh, come on, you made it to the final step. If you can just kill every potato that's on the screen, you'll manage to make it happen. Wait, more fighting efficiency. Did that work? There's a very real world chance that that was the difference. <laughs> Sick. Now I feel good enough to go into 1-8. Gear matters because I'll get another button at 1-8-50 if I can survive that. And I also get like a new worm thing I can start increasing stuff into. Also, what are my skulls sitting at? Ooh, 30,000. Fun. Okay, increase attack by an extra 200%. Let me go into this fewer potatoes needed per wave situation. And then if I use the rest of my skulls and just boosting my HP and regen, that now just straight up gave me 10 million HP. I feel like we're on our way to greatness. Or the psych ward, one of the two. 
I feel like I kind of just get my health shredded here. Oh, hey, but I'm about to level up again. Fun. More fighting efficiency. Dude, I'm so close to the 50 mark. I can get up to 8-43, I think. I just need a few more upgrades and I should be able to make it happen. Try boosting my attack up by an extra 50% here. Also got enough potatoes. I can upgrade this thing. They should grow faster. Dude, even at 100 million HP, these guys hurt. But come on, we made it to 48, 49. Get there. Yes. What is this? Oh, I can like reincarnate. Oh, so like even though this skill here is based in farming, if I wanted to, I could start over here and get whatever this class is boosted up. Reloader? <laughs> and just take like different paths. Neat. Will that do give me an extra like 42% attack and HP and regen on top of everything else, along with like more class XP? That could be extremely useful, actually. I think I also get access to like every reincarnation button. Yeah, like this one. Okay, well, I'm intrigued, but I kind of already dumped all my skulls into increasing my HP and attack by a thousand percent. So I want to see if I'll actually be able to hang on and beat 1-8 real quick. Looks like the answer is no. You do get a ton of more skulls now though, but I feel like we've hit a good wall of our power. In that case, yeah, scoot, reincarnate. Oh cool, I kept my farm. Oh, and my gear? It's like a new enchanting system now. Oh yeah, also everything's just juiced up like crazy. I've already got five talent points I can spend. All right, well if you want to see more of this game, seeing just how crazy it can actually be, leave me a comment letting me know. Until then, thanks so much for watching. I'll see ya.